Hey guys, Eamon here, back with another Legend of Korra reaction. We are on the season three finale. Absolutely wild. Um, yeah, it's been a long, been, been a long road to get here, but we're here. Um, yeah, I don't know. There's a ton of tons has happened. Like last episode was absolutely wild. So I'm very curious to see how they wrap this up in only 20 minutes. But I feel like I've said that for, for pretty much all the finales of every season, dating back to Avatar. So um, they usually do a pretty good job at the finale. So I'm expecting some awesome stuff here. Um, a lot of questions though i do not know what they're doing with that poison with cora that was very um that was probably the last thing i was expecting them to say when uh when they showed that final scene there of the episode but um yeah let's just hop into it make sure to drop a sub drop a like comment your thoughts and uh yeah chapter 13 venom of the red lotus all right once we administer this poison Forcing you into the Avatar state in an effort to keep you alive. Sadly for oh. you, you'll be entering it for the last time. No! What? The Avatar cycle! Yes. When we oh. the Avatar state, the cycle will end. Together, we will forge a world without hmm. kings and queens. We will return to the true balance of natural order. Your name will echo throughout history. Korra, the last Avatar. Oh, shit. The last avatar. Oh shit. Okay. Well, that's. There you go. Perfect. Oh geez, yeah, they're badly hurt. Cora will come to save us, right? I think no. we're gonna have to do this on our own. Yeah, let me pause that for a second. So the. So did he lie then when he first spoke to Cora? He lied about what his plan was. I think then, right? Because did wasn't she a part of his plan, like, to help him, like restore balance or am i misremembering so his, his actual plan was to take her out and just end the avatar overall and then like rebuild like destroy the world as well and rebuild everything it was kind of what his thing was so that came out of nowhere i don't know why i didn't think of that but that makes a lot of sense administer the poison jeez oh man No. Get ready. As soon as she's in the Avatar state, take her out. Oh my god. How is she going to get out of this? Why isn't she staying in the Avatar state? She's like so powerful that she can control it. Yeah, she's like, okay. She's like literally controlling her, controlling it. That's it. Down there, Lefty. Lefty? <laughs> Even a bit Lefty? That's funny. I'm not coming out without our children and the rest of your people. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is happening like the same time then, right? Yeah. They're, they're at the same place. Shh. Come on, Cora. I told you, Cora. Oh shit. The world doesn't need you anymore. No way. Time of the Avatar is Oh my god. Cora. This is crazy. Your two Jeez. Let go. Let go. Oh my god, that Let is go. a terrifying visual. Let go. Spooky season with that one. I gotta go, Pete. Me too. <laughs> hey, keep it down over there. Here you go. Oh, we just have the keys, okay. <laughs> What do you think you're doing? <laughs> oh my god, that guy's dead. Oh, let's go with something. So glad you're safe. <laughs> oh. Me too. <laughs> oh my god. Forgot about that. You're alive. I can't believe it. Why? <laughs> you don't have to search for her. I know exactly where she's being held. Let's go. <sighs> Oh fuck. Now destroy the avatar. Hey, there we go. Yeah, I was gonna I should have said that. I was gonna say she's so strong she could like pull the chains out of the wall. <laughs> Dude. Good lord. 
Yeah, they did not think that through, I don't think. Holy smokes. Jeez. Cora. Jesus. Is she flying now too? Or no, she has the she's using the fire, yeah. Holy crap. Is this the same place as the uh, Bang versus the Fire Lord? Looks very similar. Daddy! <laughs> we have to help Korra. Well, a lot has changed since then. Let's go. Let's go, Olin. <laughs> so that's how you got out of the temple. <laughs> Not bad. Let's see what you got. This is crazy having like it's like a fully fully like airborne fight. Jeez. Oh my god. <laughs> Just throwing a, a, like a cliff at him. Oh, let's go. Let's go throw him up balance, right? Yeah, totally throws him up balance. Oh, oh the poison. Uh oh. Damn, the poison is knocking her out now. She has no power. You can't fight me and the poison. Shh. He's unlocked powers of airbending that haven't existed for thousands of years. We have power together. Mm -hmm. They could like create like a yeah. They could create like a crazy like wind tunnel or something like that, right? <laughs> it's over. No, I feel like she can. Ooh. Have we seen her? Can she blood bend? We haven't seen her blood bend. I don't think. Uh oh, get out of the water! Get out of the water! Uh. Oh my god! Oh. Dude. Dude. Yeah, that was that was lightning. I thought that might have been like one of Asami's gadgets, but that, he did that. He unlocked that too. We hadn't seen him do that, right? I don't think. The lightning bending. Let's go knock up a win. I'm never going back to prison. If I'm going down today, you're coming with me! Oh, jeez. Come on, tof. All right. Okay, that, that's three insane deaths. Or four, I guess, actually. No, three? Yeah, three. Three. So here's the last one standing. Jeez. Oh. That is a big drop. The poison has done its work. The Avatar cycle will be over momentarily. No, no. Uh-oh. Not like that. Come on. There we go, there we go, let's go. They gotta get out of that thing though. Oh. oh my god. There we go, there we go, okay. Oh, we can't get away, it's pulling them in, yeah. There we go, there we go. Let's go, Cora. <laughs> get him, get him quick, get him quick, get him quick. There we go. Good, good, good. Cora, sweetheart, it's me, Dad. 
Please hang on. Oh, jeez. The poison's been in her system too long. The Red Lotus has won. No. You can save her. The poison is metallic. Oh, this, they can pull it out? Nice. That's crazy. Let's go. I feel like it probably should have been a bit more gruesome coming out because it would, would be in her blood and stuff, right? Wouldn't it? Not her like mouth, or, but still crazy. Oh yeah, I first she didn't know he was alive. Yeah. I'm never gonna let you. <laughs> the revolution has already begun. Chaos is the natural order of all. Whoa. <laughs> you see what I did there? I put a sock in it, literally. Classic Bolin. Yeah. I do what I do. The revolution has begun, though. All fixed up for a formal avatar appearance. Take a look. It's great. Yeah, she doesn't look too Thanks. good. <laughs> her eyes are all like, you know, she's got my eyes with the, right <laughs> the giant bags in her eyes. It's only been two weeks. You need time hmm. to heal. Is she sad talk? because of? Hey. Uh, we'll, we'll talk about it after. Let's just try to enjoy this today. You look beautiful, sweetie. <laughs> I'd like to officially welcome you back to Republic City. I know Screw off, man. <laughs> saw each other. It didn't end on the best terms. I can mm. help. I want to ride with Cora. Cora's <laughs> already inside. Is this is this Janora becoming like an airbending uh, master? Is that what this is a ceremony this. for? Nice. Tough throwback. Neither would you if you'd gone through what she had. The poison took a great toll. Yeah, I don't think it's the poison that's I'm just saying with the Earth Kingdom in complete disarray. We still don't know how many red lotus mm -hmm. members might be out there hiding. Jinora, come forward. Mm -hmm. Today we welcome the first air yeah. master. Let's go, Jinora. And I couldn't be more proud of my daughter. <laughs> Thanks to her leadership, I see a very bright future for the Air Nation. Of course, there would be no Air Nation without Avatar Korra. She opened the portals and somehow the world began anew for us. And she was even willing to lay down her own life in order to protect ours. But we can follow her example of service and sacrifice. We will serve people of all nations, <laughs> working wherever there is corruption and discord to restore balance and peace. Avatar Korra, I vow that we will do everything in our power to follow in your footsteps and bring harmony to the world. <laughs> nice. She cut her. She had. She had the shaved head. Hmm. <laughs> no, oh, it just ended like okay. That was a good ending. I thought there might be more there, but all right. All right, so that was the season three finale, Legend of Korra. Um, yeah, what do I, what do we start with there? I guess, yeah, very good, very good. Uh, um, I was literally thinking, just before the ending, I was thinking that this finale didn't really impact me emotionally as much as the other finales have, but then it got me at the end with Jinora's, uh, <laughs> Jinora and Tenzin there at the end, so that's, yeah, that's perfect. Um, yeah, great, great, great fight scene. Like the fight scenes in Korra, especially, are just like, like the the upgrade animation from like Avatar is it, it's really cool for the for the fight scenes. Um, definitely some awesome stuff. But yeah, so the, we basically are having a whole sequence now of um, yeah, like the Red Lotus is known about, but no one really knows much about it. And obviously, um, Zaheer is not gonna like tell anyone who's like plotting with them. But um, but yeah, so but Korra though, Korra, I don't know if it was her. I think it was more her spirit that was broken at the end there. Like they, like obviously she's hurt and stuff, but I think she actually like. Yeah, I was kind of thinking maybe it was she's like realizing like she kind of agrees with us here on some level. That's kind of what I was my thought was immediately when I saw her face. Like she was kind of like she's happy she beats it here, but she also at the same time realizes like 
some some of what he said makes sense i guess is kind of what i was thinking i don't i don't know i don't know exactly but yeah really good season um i guess what would season two or season four be season four is the last one right so i guess it, yeah i guess it'd be stomping out the red lotus is like the plot, plot of that one restoring like everything i guess the leaders the leaders are still corrupt of like all the major nations right other than the fire nation i think other than uh unless lord zuko is uh is it is it it's his daughter right that's the fire lord we, we haven't met her have we i don't think we've did we meet her we might have met her for a second but like it's po i mean it's possible she's corrupt i don't think she would be because zuko would have been a great uh obviously zuko's like extremely wise and stuff and probably would have been very hard on like stomping out any sort of like weirdo behavior by by his daughter but who knows but yeah so the earth, the earth kingdom is also completely fried and the earth kingdom is like i'm pretty sure the earth kingdom is like the biggest one right by by like land size and all that and population size so that's a big issue of course um yeah yeah i don't know season four i'm expecting good things from season four like it's it's the creators of these shows are so good at like wrapping things up like the finale of Avatar was insane, so I'd assume End of Korra would be insane too. And all the finales too of like every season have been just great. So very excited for season four. And yeah, season three. Season three was definitely really good. Um, I think it started off a bit slower than I thought it would season season three. But like the plot, like the threads throughout and like the ideas that of what could happen were definitely like there throughout throughout the whole thing and stuff. So really good stuff um i i would rank it would i rank it yeah it's definitely the best core season i don't think i would rank it ahead of um i mean it's hard to compete with like like the the high the highs of avatar are just like a lot higher than Korra to me like just some like the best moments i've seen in like television or in avatar um there's still great stuff in Korra, but and i think I, there's a lot of characters in Korra that i like like more than i did in um avatar but yeah um yeah i don't know what else to say I, I really gotta start writing stuff down throughout the episodes and stuff so i know much more to talk about but um yeah it was good i, I hope we do see more to here in season four i'd assume we will if he's locked up like they're gonna interrogate him and stuff right I, i'd assume at some point so he could actually be a valuable um going with what i was saying about core maybe agreeing with some of his points about like maybe not like completely destroying the world to rebuild it but like taking down not like murdering but like trying to like semi take down nations i guess and rebuild them that way like maybe she could take the lead in, in like rebuilding the earth kingdom herself that'd be yeah that'd be interesting i guess um actually toff could toff toff has to be toff, there, there's no way toff's not going to be in season four there's no way could she take the the mantle of the Earth Kingdom? That would make a lot of sense. Yeah, yeah. So that that I'm, I'm looking, for, looking forward to that in season four. I, if if Toph's not in it, I'll be disappointed. Don't don't tell me in the comments. Don't tell me if I'm wrong about that. I really hope she is though. Um, that'd be a major letdown for me actually if she's not in season four at some point. I gotta think she is, but yeah. But no. But so if yeah, like I could see Korra like using the here as like a like talking to him a lot for like just about things like yeah those those would be interesting scenes i think for sure yeah i don't know yeah i guess we'll just wrap up there thanks for watching make sure to sub like the video comment your thoughts below let me know your thoughts on like the season as a whole um let me stuff i missed especially I'm, I'm sure i miss lots of stuff i i usually do you guys usually fill me in with stuff i missed but um yeah, there's a, there's a, there's a lot. It's the there, yeah. It's it's been yeah. Yeah, it's it's a good show. It's a good show. Anyways, so season 4 season 4 will start uh will start when I start. It, it'll be it won't be like a big break if if it if it does happen. I'll make sure to get one up. I'll get, make sure to get season 4 up at least like starting at the latest next week. Um but yeah. Yeah, and then also I guess we do need to start getting uh ideas for another show to watch. Um there is a show what is it invincible or attack on titan there, there's some like big like cartoon anime show that has like a new season coming out i think so let me know what show that is i forget the name of it it's like it's like one that's airing now that's like pretty popular um so that might be good to react to if we start season one up and then get to the next season or whatever but um i forget what it's called but yeah if you think i'd like it let me know obviously i like uh 
big sci-fi fan, so like if this, if like I'd be interested to see like a cartoon slash anime that's like related to like sci-fi instead of like like what's a Avatar? Would that be like fantasy? Fantasy stuff, I think, is what it would be referred to as like a as a as the as the genre. I think I don't even know. Yeah, fantasy. Yeah, like mystical fantasy type thing. I guess is what it'd be. be but yes, yeah, so like something around that would be would be great to watch. I don't know. We'll see. Anyways, thanks for watching. Have a good one.